I never thought I would be anything but a famous professional artist. But then I learned about conservation when I was finishing up art school, and I thought, now that's something really interesting. Since I was a kid, I always knew that I would be involved in the arts. I had an affinity for gear and all things technical. And so I looked into what it takes to become a conservator. I started to learn about the science aspects and it really jived with who I am. I've worked on art by Warhol, Basquiat, a portrait of George Washington by Charles Wilson Peale. Every project I do has a new set of challenges. When I'm called to analyze a painting, I don't always know the setting it's gonna be in. What I need to present to my clients, I have to give them confidence. They're hiring me because I do the best work and I have the best tools. This is my first Leatherman tool, Leatherman Super Tool. My dad gave it to me and I've always been very close with my dad. My dad is who taught me how to fix things. So ever since I was a kid, I was all about being prepared. It's really important for me to have every bit of gear I need to answer the questions that are asked of me. How old their painting is, who it was painted by, and how to care for it. Every time I go to a project and I'm able to meet those challenges, it gives me the confidence to do it again the next time. And that's really what growing is all about. It's about getting better at what I do. It's about developing, developing my skills, developing my craft. It's part of who I am.